Dishwasher. Shit washer. Oh, wow. Alright. Hey, film me. Film me, not the pan. <laughs> Welcome to video number two of the Big Pen Diaries. Special guests Biggie, Frank, Robert, Robert Grizzly, Biggie, Biggie, Swine, Wild Boar, Frank, and Josh. And Josh. Rob. King, King. King? You're the king? Yeah, I'm, like I'm the king. And, uh, oh, the man with the camera? Mystery. Retardo. Mystery play. Mystery play. <laughs> <laughs> okay, all right. So, Mr. Big Frankie is having some uh, eight ounce beef and some rice because he was starving. He did, he did arms over here. Me and Josh fucking smashed legs. Smashed. Smashed. It smashed and uh, we need to eat we try to get some sushi somewhere some clean uh, food over there but everything was closed so we're gonna have to cook some stuff so let's start cooking and a lot of people ask me about coconut oil oh really you should cook with that and with olive oil you should butter is uh, hey, Antoine. better than what hey Antoine what why do you cook with uh, coconut oil <laughs> I will tell you why Mr. Frankie Pig <laughs> so coconut oil Resist eat at high temperature. It stays the same. It doesn't modify and it stays good for you. When you heat olive oil, if you heat it, it goes bad and it's bad for your body. And saturated fats can uh, are more resistant to the heat. So you rather cook with butter than olive oil. But if you're not cooking anything with oil or butter, olive oil is better because it's more saturated. It's good fats. So you should add butter. Uh, you should add olive oil to your food after it's cooked. Don't cook in it. Cook into this. Zoom. Yeah. Right. Shut up. <laughs> 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 Again! Oh! Ah! Feel tense! Oh! Shit! Go! What the fuck is this? These bodybuilders must consume this 96% lean beef or their muscles will go into a catabolic state and they might die. Our two beef meals. One is a post-workout actually. So uh, we're gonna have uh, two cups each here and here. And then the other one is um, actually when I work out in the morning, it's my fourth meal. So uh, it's one cup of rice for me and it's only one cup of rice for Josh too. So very practical. You saw it yesterday. Jasmine rice. So here, here, and one bag for two meals. Right here. And it's, those bags are awesome. If you have the Joe's, um, get it. It's a three minutes for one bag. Just put it like that in the microwave. Three. That's it. And it's very good tasting rice. It's good. It's good. All right, guys. Um, two cuts of rice. With beef, two cups of rice with beef, one cup of rice with beef, one cup of rice with beef. So eight ounces of beef in there. And um, this is gonna be my um, chicken, <clears throat> chicken and um, veggies meal. No carbs there. Chicken is cooking there on low heat, covered up so it stays moist and doesn't stick. And I cook all my stuff with coconut oil. I keep saying it, but it's important. All right. So um, after that, I have three meals down. So tomorrow I wake up, cook some breakfast, yes. eggs, and some meat, oatmeal. Yes. I'm gonna have this meal after that, and then probably the veggie meal. Then at 6 p.m. I'm gonna work out, and then eat this after my workout. I also um, take two scoops of this with one tablespoon of natural peanut butter um, as part of my meals. It's pretty my uh, it's gonna be. My um, third meal is going to be this. Um, that's my peanut butter. That's yours, whoops. That's his. Mine is right here. Oh yeah, there. Because mine, the ingredients are 
organic dry roasted peanuts. His organic dry roasted peanuts and sea salt. Oh, you found it. <laughs> he was looking for that. The palm oil <laughs> stuff. Minutes. Watch out, sometimes it says, tell me. <laughs> sometimes it says organic peanut butter, blah, 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 but they add sugar and palm oil into it. But uh, that's okay. This is mine. That's okay. Yeah, it's yours. Uh, I like the sea salt, that's some taste to it. All right, but that's okay too. So make sure, even if it says natural peanut butter, make sure there's no added ingredients except one ingredient, and that's the nuts. Just the nuts. Just you just the want nuts. the nuts, right? Just the nuts? You just want the nuts salty? in your mouth. You like salty nuts? Peanuts. Salty nuts. Are we going to put this on YouTube? Don't. A good way to add flavor so to your bad. meals when you diet okay. is shut the f up! That I took my. <laughs> <laughs> a good way to add flavor to your meals when you're dieting for a show is adding hot sauce because it has no calories, just a little bit of sodium. So, um, I don't know about Josh, but I'm gonna pound that stuff in there. Hot sauce. Usually I use Frank's Red Up, but I didn't find it at the Trader Joe's. Probably because it's not organic, it's full of chemicals, of good That's tasting right. chemicals. Full of chemicals. Yeah. Right. Open your mouth. You're not game. Shut the fuck up. Come on, come on. You're on camera. You first. You first. <laughs> no way, man. You're, you're the man. Come on. Swallow the juice. <laughs> <laughs> Swallow the juice. Yeah. <laughs> There's not to our mass line. Eat it. It's good for you. Eat it. <laughs> All the meals are done. So now we have to put them in the pig box. Alright. My meals. The chicken and veggies, the cups of rice, and the beef. Right here. And Josh's. He has uh, rice with his chicken because he needs to gain the muscle. It's already cut. Alright, so big box right there. And it seems as though the food has been cooked and prepped. And it looks like the bodybuilders will be able to outlast another day in the wild. Special guest is a very useful right now. <laughs> it's fucking useless. Okay.